we all only have so much time and we want to spend it in ways that are meaningful to ourselves. Yet when we look at somebody with a disability, we think, well, their time's not important. But that's not true at all. Don't we all want to be important to other people? When you have a child with a disability, when they become an adult, you look at services and you find a group home for them to live in and you find a a workshop for him to work in, and you find maybe a day program for him to spend leisure time in. When Joe out of high school, I would have never dreamed that he could be in the regular world doing regular things with other people. When we started this, he didn't have anybody that I would call my friend. He was lonely, right? He was like, kind of lack of purpose. You know, I always knew Joe was lovable. I love him to death but didn't always give other people credit to think that they could ignore all of that stuff about Joe that wasn't quite perfect or that wasn't like other people and appreciate him for the real person that he is. I guess the most important thing that helped me turn that corner is seeing it. Stepping back enough to just watch the interplay between Joe and another person whose feelings for him were growing. I have found that people are more than happy to introduce Joe as their friend and, and to talk about the good things that he does. Joe's life now is so totally different than what it would have been if he didn't have those people in his life. He would be wasting his time.